What's going on, MLive Live followers? I'm Tony Garcia, sports reporter at the Jackson Citizen Patriot, and this is Tony's take. I'm not sure when this happened, but uh, somehow it's already week eight. Uh, party's almost over, and uh, that means it's the last week of Cascades Conference play. Uh, next week, Cascades Conference and Big Eight have the crossover game to wrap up the regular season, and then it's off to the playoffs. And uh, so the game we're going to be taking a look at this week, the first one is uh, one and six East Jackson heading over to five and two Napoleon. Napoleon looking to wrap up its second consecutive playoff uh, appearance and uh, really doing it with some long winning streaks in both seasons. Last season it, it rattled off a, a nine game winning streak uh, after starting the season 0 and 2. This year started 2 and 2, um, has won three in a row and five of its last six. And a lot of the reason is because of its dynamic offense. Last year the Pirates set a school record with uh, 31 points per game and it might have been even more if they hadn't been held to just, or would have been, if they hadn't been held to just six in uh, their regional championship loss. But this year they are uh, averaging up, up more around the 34 mark. And, um, I mean, just nobody's really been able to slow them down this year. East Jackson's offense was looking pretty good early uh, with this guy, Daniel Poole, as well as running back Zach Seymour. But as they've got, gotten into conference play, have struggled to uh, have as much consistency as they did early. And uh, one thing that has helped Napoleon this year is they're more well-rounded. Uh, last season... All three of their losses came when they were held to 18 points or fewer, and they scored 25 points or more in each of their wins. So they were a little bit too dependent on their offense. This year, they have already won a game in which they uh, only scored 17 points, and that was against the co-leaders in the Cascades Conference, uh, the Michigan Center Cardinals, when Michigan Center scored just 14. But they've also lost when they scored 30, when they gave up 32 to Addison. So it has gone both ways. But I see... Uh, Napoleon wrapping up its share of the Cascades Conference title for the second consecutive season. Uh, Napoleon should be able to win this one pretty big, but it's not as if East Jackson doesn't have some positives going on this season. Um, whenever they score their next point, which I imagine they will do at some point over the next two weeks, it will be the most points East Jackson has scored in any season in five years. So uh, that early start is showing something, that, that there was something there, and that th this program still moving forward. But... Not enough firepower uh, to hang with Napoleon. I see this one getting out of hand pretty quickly. Make it Napoleon 45, East Jackson 6.